1999's Galaxy Quest is a classic spoof of sci-fi TV shows like Star Trek. But at the end of the movie, just how fictional are the new adventures aboard the Protector? Didn't you make any TV shows on your planet? That's right. The ending isn't the new, modern show within a show we're led to believe. Galaxy Quest The Journey Continues isn't a rebooted sci-fi series at all. It's a reality show, and the stars are going on actual adventures in space. Why? Because they're on a mission to find beryllium spheres. Beryllium sphere has fractured under stress. It's fractured. When the government learned that the Thermians could hunt for beryllium spheres on other planets using a real spaceship, it decided to use the relationship the actors have with the aliens in order to get some of that sweet, sweet energy for themselves. Beryllium, the fuel source for the ship's reactor that the actors find during the movie, is a real element in the real universe. Humans can use it to build satellites, spaceships, even for nuclear energy. Who knows what other secrets of the universe the Thermians could have helped us unlock? Everyone wins. The evil government get their nuclear fuel source, Hollywood spends zero on movie sets or writers for the rebooted series, the Thermians remain alongside their heroes, and Jason and the gang get the biggest career boost of their lives. By Grab Thar's Hammer, production will save money on CGI. Because when you star in a sci-fi series space show, and you also have an actual spaceship, you friggin' use it.